Day six. I am sick. Keeping the energy up anyway. Um, I'm sick, still streaming. Today we're going to talk about the spring. All right, so the spring is Charity Water's monthly giving subscription. Now, what is this and why is that important? If you're a charity, you do not have a stream of income. You have to go out every year and start over for your fundraising efforts. So Charity Water has been around a little over 10 years and every year, just about every year, they've grown in terms of donations and reach and number of water projects and they've continued to grow and grow and grow. But at some point, it becomes difficult for them to continue to grow because if you could imagine if you ra if you raised you know 30 million dollars in a year and then you have to start over at the beginning the next year and raise another 30 million dollars but you have no products you have no subscriptions it's like starting from scratch you have to convince the whole world that again that to give money to solve the problem so the spring is charity waters solution uh to this fundraising issue in which you or me or anyone can sign up for a uh, monthly subscription and auto auto debit any amount of money you choose from their account. Um, what's kind of cool about this is, uh, you know, this is really the spring is the, how we truly end the water crisis, how we keep a steady flow of money going into a organization that is then contributing 100% of that money into the cause into solving the global water crisis. So for for the spring, you might be saying, well, I can't really afford it. Um, you know, I can't have another monthly uh, debit. But if everybody just gave like three bucks a month, that would be $36 a year. Even at that level, you'd be bringing clean water to one person every year. And if we all did that, if we all gave $3 a month, we'd have the problem solved relatively fast. Uh, but just to give you an idea, you know, I think a lot of us have subscriptions in our lives that we don't necessarily need or we make sacrifices for. Um, just in my own life, I'm subscribed to Spotify, Hulu, and Netflix. These are all like roughly $15 a month subscriptions. So with that, if you're, if you're giving, you know, for a service that you enjoy, I would encourage you to maybe give a little bit also monthly to a service that could save somebody's life. Um, this, if, if you're on the fence about donating to my campaign, um, I would prefer that you actually go donate to the spring, that you make this a recurring thing. Um, I'm doing this for a month, but just because I stopped streaming after a month um, and getting in your faces, yelling at you about clean water, that doesn't mean that the problem goes away. Um, it, it will go away eventually if we keep working at it and we keep putting money into it and we keep raising awareness. Uh, but what we're talking about is a crisis. How do we stop 1,400 children under the age of five from dying every day? And the solution is the spring, a steady stream of money coming into a charity that's devoted and transparent and putting 100% of their efforts into solving the global water crisis. Um, that's what it is. That's why it's important. <sighs> My throat is killing me. But... On that note, I was thinking this morning, I, I don't usually take baths, I've been taking more recently, but I um, took a hot bath this morning because I was freezing and I uh, had the chills and um, you know, as much as I don't want to hop on live stream and talk to everybody today when my throat hurts, uh, it's pretty nice that I can uh, drink a hot cup of tea when I'm not feeling well or that I can run a hot bath or gargle salt water, do whatever I want with all this clean water that I have access to. and. And I, I mentioned yesterday on one of my evening streams that that uh, that's not the case for everybody. That when they're sick, that there's probably probably an emphasis to maybe even avoid water, because um, I can imagine that when you're sick, your immune system's in a weakened state. I need all my scientists and medical people to uh, tell me whether or not that's true in the comments. But um, if your if your immune system is already weakened because you're fighting a disease, I can imagine that. Uh, drinking contaminated water actually 
could make that worse. You could contract another disease or the bacteria that you were normally very good at fighting against, you were no longer good at fighting against, and that could make you sicker and possibly cause you to die. So where we in America and other first world countries have the privilege of saying, hey, I'm sick, I'm gonna stay hydrated, drink lots of fluids. Um, in other countries, that might literally be the opposite of what they wanna do. And uh, I can tell you, uh, all I wanna do is drink a bunch of hot tea and, and water when I am sick. So um, I'm grateful for that. I'm uh, sad that that's uh, not the case for everybody in the world. So even though I'm not feeling good, not feeling 100%, I'm gonna keep streaming. Um, we're on day six. Uh, we got, if you count today, we got 25 uh, days left, 24. I don't know, do you count the day that you're on? Math is hard, I think if you count today, we have 25 days left. We got five days in the books. Days one through four are on the blog, streamforwells.com. Uh, day five will go up uh, sometime today. Got all those uh, clips already uploaded and uh, we'll write up a little recap. We talked yesterday about Charity Water and what they're all about. Um, and then of course, uh, tomorrow we'll have day six recap when we're talking about the spring. So again, the spring, if you're just joining in or if you're watching this after the replay, the spring is the solution, the long-term solution for ending this problem, giving a little bit of money, making a little bit of sacrifice out of our lives. Um, I mean, if you can give, like I said, $3 a month, that's, that's awesome. That means one person every year you're going to be, uh, providing clean water to, and that, uh, you know, you don't know, that could save that person's life. So what if you were saving one life a year for the cost of like two McDoubles? Like I, I don't know, there's so many different ways to parse the information and, and really like you don't have to be a donor that's giving thousand dollars a month. Um, you know, we can, you've heard the, uh, phrase death by a thousand cuts. Um, this is a problem that we can solve with the, uh, donations of the small, uh, donations of a million, a million people. Um, if a, if a million people were giving $3 a month, that would be $30 million a month. That would mean that we'd be bringing clean water to 3 million people every single month. Um, and that would be a huge boon for this issue, a huge, a huge path to solving the, solving the global water crisis once and for all. Uh, so that's what I got for you today. I'm going to not keep talking, um, cause it really does feel like my tonsils got in a boxing match last night and, uh, they both lost. <laughs> so it was a mutual self-destruction. Uh, we're going to get off this stream here in a second and then issue out some challenges. Um, I'm not sure who I'm challenging today, but, uh, I'll, I'll figure that out here in the next couple minutes. Um, so look for those, uh, didn't get any acceptors to my challenges yesterday. So still waiting to hear back from people. Um, other stream updates, the guy that joined my campaign, a friend of a friend, uh, joined it to help raise money. He's doing awesome. He's raised a couple hundred bucks. So collectively we're up to uh, almost $500 raised, which is awesome. That's uh, uh, what one, one sixth of the way to our goal of $3,000 or bringing clean water to a hundred people. Um, and uh, those hundred people could be anyone. It could be your could be like a family member or a friend. Um, and it is somebody's family member or a friend in these communities. So uh, the number that we have to solve for is big, but um, you know, making a difference in one, per one person's life at a time is uh, still critical because they're a person and we shouldn't get so uh, drugged down by the big number. Um, it's just about making a difference one person at a time. That's really what this is about. That's what the spring can do for people. So if you are on the fence about joining the campaign, maybe you don't feel like you have a big amount of money to give, go to charitywater.org, click on the spring. Also, if you go to streamforwells.com and FAQ, I have a link to the spring there um, as well. Uh, so uh, yeah, check it out. Um, if you're watching this and you want to join my challenge uh, and do it for 24 hours, 48 hours, maybe you want to do it for a week, 
You want to join the big dogs, do it for a long time until people start listening. Um, you can do that and find instructions at streamforwells.com slash start. It's hard to remember to keep drinking things on these morning streams because I feel like I have to fill the void with talking, but this is really about being grateful for access to clean water and, uh, the inconvenience it is for other people to collect contaminated water. All right, if this video uh, made sense to you, if it resonated with you, if uh, you think it's something you believe in, do me a huge favor, like it, love it, comment on it, and of course share it. Sharing is how the we will get the information out and maybe you sharing it will cause one other person to join the spring as well. And uh, that could that could make all the difference. So um, thanks for following along. Uh, thanks for uh, for supporting me in this cause and supporting uh, Charity Water for uh, trying to really just save lives um, and bring everybody up to a standard of living that we that so many of us take for granted. So again, like, like, share, comment, um, head on to the website for the daily recap, streamforwells.com. Check it out. If you're not, if you're sick of watching these daily streams, you can just do it all in one go on there. Um, it'd mean the world to me and mean the world for people that do not have access to clean water. Thanks again for listening. This has been your day six morning stream. I'm sick. I'm still here. We'll talk to you all soon.